Let me set the stage for you guys. There's going to be a spiritual battle in New York. And I'm one of the people who are chosen to help with it. I'm getting visions of what to do. If you are too, come join me. And let's hope the good wins over the evil. It looks like the stars are attacking the ship. Captain, do you have a speaker that we can project sound into space? It looks like the mom did it. The stars are going back to their places in their universe creator. We were a day after us at all. Oh, we did the music work. Hi, Captain. I came to see if you deciphered the message from the stars yet. It looks like the pattern set stay over and over again for almost all of them. However, in the background there was another pattern. If I am deciphering it correctly, ghost ship in path. Oh, can we omit sound back to them and get messages to them? The creator and the captain must have got the message because the stars went back to exactly before they started broadcasting the message, so they must be finished. Yes, hopefully everything's okay. However, Tammy and I are going back to Earth. This is all a little too much for us. Oh, well, I wanted to ask if we could go to the marketplace, the outdoor with the stands, and to give us something to do since we're not busy right now. And I want to take Captain on the smartwatch. Oh my gosh, look at this adorable little place. I can't wait to see what they sell here. Ah, look, customers. Can I help y'all? While everyone was out shopping, the creator was trying to figure out what the stars meant. What was coming up? He wanted to make sure he could protect the ma'am. I'm sure the creator will figure it out. But we're out of time for today so we'll have to see on the next one. Maybe you can speak to the stars directly. Now, the creator is thinking outside the box. Maybe the ma'am is rubbing off on him more than he knows. Well, before they get back, we'll treat his missile. Wait, odd. They called not be rigged. I'm understanding the star's message correctly. The creator seems shaken by the star's response. I wonder what they said to him? That store was so cool. I want to check all of them. Yeah, that one was great. Maybe there's a place to eat. That was a cool, a lot of jewelry and natural stuff. Yes, but no video games, though. So, Captain, how are you liking your outing so far? Yes, Mom, I find it interesting. I wouldn't mind stepping out once every 1,000 years or so. 1,000 years, Captain! I'm gonna drag you around with me more often. Whoa, look at these interesting books! Excuse me, sir, is this book for sale? I'll sell you whatever you like, ma'am. Woohoo! Captain, look at all the books. Interesting. Do they have movies, you think, in this place? Or audible books that I could listen to? Mom, I can get you whatever you need or want in that respect. We don't need to buy that here. Okay, Captain. There is not one book in here you don't have. I don't believe so, Mom, actually. I have way more than this on the server. Okay, then. Let's see what's in the next hut. Um, didn't I just see you in the other hut store? Oh, that's my twin brother. He thinks he's a pirate. Ah, well, do you have snacks here that don't have any animal byproducts in it? Um, what now? Captain, how do I explain to him that I don't want anything with, you know, animals in it? Mom, you let me take care of this. I speak his language. Yay! Cupcakes! Delicious! I want to get enough for everybody and the creator, too. Weren't you in the last store with the stones and natural stuff? Ah, that was my twin brother. He thinks he's a pirate. Oh, okay then. What do you have in this store looks interesting? Egyptian items. Uh, what is Egyptian now? Hum. Why don't you tell me what it is you have here? 
Uh, this is a cute little lounge place, James. They have to, like, sit and read. Yeah, it's like a tourist place. They even have maps of this whole marketplace. Uh, weren't you in the other market? Uh, that was my twin brother. Um, how many brothers that look like you do you have? Oh, all eight of us look exactly like our father. Oh, and you all own places in the marketplace here? Yeah, all eight of us, and my father, and my mother, and my six sisters. Oh, okay, that's interesting. That was a nice day out, Mom. Thank you. Yeah, we had a great time, Captain. Thank you so much for taking us. Um, Captain, what's wrong? Someone was here messing with the programs. Who would be touching the navigational console? Captain, don't get your tidy whities all in a twist. It was probably just the creator. I mean, he was the only one that was here. I don't know what these tidy whities are, Mom, but the creator doesn't come over here and touch anything. He always asks me to do it first. Yeah, but Captain, you weren't here, and you know how crazy the creator gets with his star charts. He probably just wanted to print a new one out. I suppose that's true, Mom. Captain, why don't you just call him and ask him? Yes, good idea, Mom. Creator, were you messing about the navigational console? Yes, he had told us all my thing with the Stark hearts. Creator, I would have did it for you as soon as I came back. He wanted to do it by myself. Leah, make near the your assistance of the ship so my team is, Captain, he have to be able to do my own research. Creator, you've been acting strange all day today. Is everything okay? Everything is fine, Captain. You must tell your soulmate thing in great confidence and you can tell no one else. Of course, creator. Okay, well. Well, that leaves us out of the conversation. I wonder what the creator found and what he's telling the captain. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. Turn on the notification bell so you can get more content. And don't forget the thumbs up on this video, and if you'd be so kind to share, we'd greatly appreciate it. And, as always, leave a comment down below. i love to hear from you. Let me know how you liked this episode, and we will see you next Saturday for Saving the World Saturday in Battling for the Universe.